Before we have finished with our producer that now produces random animal names each second and now let's create a consumer that will consume those messages from animals topic. And for this let's create another file here in the root of our project and let's name it consumer.js. And let's now copy a part of the code from producer.js file. Let me go here. Let me temporarily close terminal. And uh, let me select uh, entire section like so. Paste uh, in consumer.js. And next uh, let me actually remove this entire produce message uh, function like this. Also we don't need chance here. And we don't need the new instance of chance. Let's remove it like so. Let's uh, replace client ID with my consumer like this broker set will be unchanged here we still have three different brokers in the cluster and here let's create a new consumer that will be result of the call to consumer method of the Kafka object and the topic will be still animals and here we will consume messages consuming here let's first connect to consumer like this and afterwards we need to subscribe to a specific topic and read messages from that topic. Let's actually go to example for Kafka JS package this one scroll down to the section with sample consumer. Here it is and we are able to use subscribe method like so and afterwards we could use run method of the consumer and uh, for example print each message to the console. Let's do that. Let me copy this part like so. Go to VS Code and uh, paste it uh, here. And uh, here we will subscribe to topic. Let's use again property shorthand because we have defined the topic here above. And we don't need to use from beginning flag, but if you want, you could leave it in place. Let's use simply subscribe to topic. And uh, here for each message, we will print to the console partition ID, offset ID of every message and value converted to string. Let's save this uh, file. Let's start first producer, go here, open up terminal and let's uh, again run it using node producer.js. Let's start it. Now it is producing uh, random animal names and now let's open up new terminal window like so. We are still located in our Kafka project. Let's uh, clear terminal and let's start consumer by entering node consumer.js. It seems that uh, there is an error. Let me scroll up and verify what is that. And it seems that we need to specify consumer group ID without that it will not work. Let me go to consumer and uh, find place where we should actually do that. Maybe here, but uh, probably it should be added uh, somewhere here in a new instance of the Kafka. Let me try to add it here. Group ID and uh, here will be consumer group like so. Let's uh, save the file and let's try to rerun our application. We still get the same error and it seems that the group ID should be specified uh, in a call to consumer method here. Let me copy it uh, from here and uh, afterwards let's add here new configuration object for consumer and paste uh, property group ID that will be equal to consumer group. Let's save the file and uh, let's try to rerun our consumer node consumer.js and now it works and we are receiving uh, new messages every second. And notice that we are getting actually messages not every second but instead we are getting them in batches after specific amount of times and we have discussed that uh, in a previous section in details. And here in the console we see partition ID. Recap that we have created uh, topic animals with five partitions. Also we see offset that is unique for every partition and we see values that are actually random names for different animals. And that means that our consumer works as was planned and now there is producer that produces messages to our Kafka cluster to topic animals and also there is a consumer that consumes messages regularly. That's all for this lesson and that's all actually for this section where we have reviewed how you are able to create a Kafka producer and Kafka consumer using Node.js. I'll see you in the next section where we will try to create consumers and producers using Python. Have a break and I'll see you next. Bye-bye.